All right, so anyway, I just bought the Arnett CO2 sensor, and uh, we're going to go ahead and open her up, and I'm going to show you how to put the batteries in it. All right, so when you open up the box, you're going to see there is a quick start guide that gives you all the information about the uh, unit itself. And if you pull it out, you're going to look on the front. It shows you how to put the batteries on. they got a little diagram there, so that's going to make it easy. So what you have to do is flip it over to the back. There's a... Uh, there's a little door there. You got to kind of push it. It pops off. And if you look inside, you're going to see where the batteries go. There's the positive side there, negative down. So you got to make sure you put the flat side on the negative and pop it in. It's a little tough to get it in. I had to push pretty hard, but I did get it in. And then we put the other battery in and kind of squeeze it in there just like that. And I've got the positive part up so you can see where it goes. You see that little red red light clicking in? That tells you that you've got power. And then we're just going to go ahead and shut that door by pushing it back on. And it takes a couple seconds, but it, it will kick in here on the very front. And you're going to be able to see your CO2. Uh, you're going to be able to see the humidity. And you're going to be able to see uh, the, the degrees. And this is in Celsius. You can change it to Fahrenheit. That's another video. But there it is. That's how you do it. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.